and welcome to the Farm and Pastor's Wife. Thank you for joining me today. I am bundled up like a, I don't know what, Eskimo. No, Judah bug, no. My Judah bug's in here helping me and he's turning my phone back because he's missing the cord. Anyway, so let's try this again. Um, I am bundled up because we are headed out to our town's Anyway, we are headed out to our town's Christmas parade. Mama. Say hello. Can you say hello? Look, can you say Jesus? Jesus. Jesus. Can you say Papa? Uh oh, he can say uh oh. He can say Papa. Say, ready, set, go. Ready, set, go. <laughs> okay, so anyway, I am bundled up. So if I look fluffier than normal, it's because I have layer upon layer upon layer upon layer of clothes. And so I wanted to make us, I'm out of Russian tea. So I wanted to make us some Russian tea so we can fill up in our Yeti cups and take with us to the Christmas parade tonight. So, no son. <laughs> I forgot what it was like to have a little one. So we're gonna start with two cups of sugar. And I'm going to get you guys turned down here. And I'm starting with two cups of sugar. These are half cup scoops. So there's half. One. Half. Two. All right. That's it for the sugar. All right. We're going to also use a half a cup of instant Judah bug. No, no. We're going to use a half a cup of, hang on just a second. <laughs> you got it. Got it. Got it. And, and this is one I got from Food Line, and this is just what it looks like. It's just lemon flavored iced tea. So we're going to use a half a cup of instant tea. And I better not put this half cup scoop back in my sugar because it'll need washing. Let's take the scooper out. Half a cup of iced tea. Or instant tea. Okay. Shoot, that stuff stinks. Alright, now in your, you can buy the Country Time Lemonade or the Walmart brand or whatever. And when you take the lid off, you'll notice that there's a line in here that says makes two quarts to fill this line. So you're going to fill it to that two quart line there. And I think my little moisture has gotten to mine just a little bit. Let me squeeze and bounce. Squeeze and bounce. should have got some new but it's okay it's just a little humidity in my house and somebody didn't get the lid on quite good there we go so there's two cups of the lemonade mixture Judah's playing in the trash can all right we're also gonna put a whole package of tang a whole entire package of tang let me get a knife to get the paper started. 
Papa doesn't know that Judabug is with us. So he's going to be surprised when he gets home. All right. So in goes the whole container of Tang. We're also going to add two teaspoons of ground cinnamon. I need my knife again. There's a little more than one, so we'll go light on this one. Two teaspoons of ground cinnamon. All right, let me grab a spoon real quick. And it's going to have these little dark lines through it. And that's the cinnamon and the instant tea. It's a really pretty mix to put in a um, jar that you can see through. All right. There you have it. This is Russian tea. Now, I'll bring you back in just a few minutes and we'll heat us up some um, water. We'll mix it with hot water and have us a good hot cup of Russian tea. Y'all, the powder from me stirring it, it even tastes good. <laughs> ah. So there you have it. That is our Russian tea. Um, y'all, I know my hair looks rough, but I'm going to wear a toboggan tonight, so it doesn't matter. But, y'all come back in just a minute. Stay right there. Don't go anywhere. I'm going to get us some water on to boil, and we'll have us a cup of Russian tea. And I'm going to fix me and Brian a cup to take to the, um, parade. And I know Mr. Judabug will drink some of ours, because he loves it too. So, y'all stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back in just a flash. Okay, y'all. I've got a little boy hanging on to my leg back here. And, um... Judah. I just put the Russian tea back in here. And I filled up this container and one of these containers with the Russian tea. So, we are just gonna... And I usually do, like, three spoonfuls. Tablespoons? Uh, just your normal spoon that you eat cereal with. Okay. And since this is a Yeti cup, I'm going to put just a little bit more. And I'm going to make Caroline one. Bryant wants cozy coffee, so we're going to make him a cozy coffee. All right. I believe it's warm enough. It's not exactly boiling, but... We'll do that in sink. Yeah, better. Not better, especially with this little boy standing around. So you could think I had an idea then. Yep. Alright, this is what the color looks like. Kind of an orange color. You don't have to do more water for your cozy coffee. She wouldn't if she hadn't spilled it. I did spill it. Alright, Mommy, anything you want to say? Hang on, I gotta taste it. I just gotta get some more water on. Judah. Y'all, this is really good, like if you have a sore throat, if you're not feeling good, and it's really good with ginger snaps. I wanted to go get me some ginger snaps. Oh, it's hot and fogged up my glasses. Y'all, that is so good. It is cinnamony, orangey. Um, 
it's just good. It's just good. And when you don't feel good, it's especially good. So y'all make some Russian tea. It's a great thing to have in the wintertime. It's something you can put on your buffet, your coffee bar buffet, and just have hot water going and people can make their own. It is wonderful. So thank y'all for watching The Farm and Pastor's Wife. We're headed to the parade. And I'll have a, probably a separate video on that uh, and something else. So, um, But y'all have a great day. Thank you for watching The Farm and Pastor's Wife. I'm going to get to making Bryant's cozy coffee. Bye, y'all.